I remember um, in, in, in my, my hospital bed, it was one of those moments where, you know, I was so proud of my wife and then a moment later just worried. <laughs> Bridget was on the phone with someone and, and they were trying to be, you know, encouraging to her and, and basically saying, hey, listen, he's, he's, he's going gonna, he's gonna to make it. He's going to be okay because, you know, God's got work for him to do. And I remember my wife on the phone saying, you know, I appreciate that, but God is no man's debtor and he doesn't need my husband. I'm praying that he spares my husband, but if he does, it won't be because he needs him. And I was like, look at you, girl. <laughs> but I'm not sure how I feel about that. <laughs> like. And she got off the phone, and I was like, but, but you need me, right? Like, I mean, we're, I mean long, you know, as long as the theology is straight over there and they're just right here, we're like, you, you need me, right? Yes, yes. So, yeah, Vody in his typical fashion. Vody's hilarious. And that's one of the reasons why I love watching his sermons, because he has a knack for taking what's biblical and giving it a kind of a hilarious twist that's uh, appropriate. Uh, and so I want to talk about a wife, a godly woman, and the significance and importance of that. You know, as terrifying and destructive as a lost woman, a godly woman to a man of God is this fortress. That's what she is. That's how important a woman of God is. I remember Paul Washer, he, was, he had a sermon, a very old sermon, where he was preaching on marriage. And I remember him saying, you know, the whole world can hate me. I can come outside my house and there can be down with Paul Washer signs. People are talking about me on the internet. I'm getting death threat, uh, death threatening mail at Heart Cry Studios. Doesn't matter, okay? As I don't care. As long as I know that my wife respects me, I can take on the world, and that's true. That's true. I know I don't. I don't have a, a woman. I don't have a, a wife. I don't have uh, a, a woman of God in my life. But I don't need to to know the significance of a woman that feareth the Lord. When a man of God is out in the world doing what he needs to do for his family, he knows that the home is solidified. He knows that home is. Is, is, is solid because he knows his wife fears the Lord. He knows that his wife is not slandering his name and talking about him behind his back because she feareth the Lord. He knows that his wife is not being inappropriate with their neighbor at home because she feareth the Lord. Everything comes back to her, 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 her devotion, uh, her, her relationship with Jesus Christ. That's what it's all about. Someone asked me a long time ago in an email, how do I know my wife loves me? How do you know your wife loves you? Tell her to tell you about her God, the God that she serves. That's everything. Okay, that's absolutely everything. And in, in regeneration, part of the newness is a new relationship with Jesus Christ. So the world has this, this, uh, this false definition of love. It's follow your heart. You know, whatever your heart feels, that's what is... Uh, adequate for, for love. That's what love is. No, it's not. Love is not a feeling. Love is a decision. Love is not void of emotions, okay? But it's uh, it's not emotions. It's not emotions. It's a literal decision. You know, can you imagine if, if God's love for us was determined by our performance? Because that's what the world, that's how the world views love. It's based on your performance. What you do for me, how you make me feel will determine how I love you. And how long I love you. And so we see here with Vodi's wife, that's a strong woman. Vodi is solid because he knows his wife is taking care of the fort. Their children are taken care of. He knows that his children are being brought up and raised in the, in the way that they should be. And the importance of a, a godly woman, especially a woman that's in the home, uh, making sure that home is, is, is how it should be. There's, there's almost nothing more important than that. Because those children that she's bringing up are going to go off into the world and they're going to be a light to the world that the world is not used to seeing. Okay, these are going to be a bunch of children that are going to grow into adulthood and are going to be godly, respectful, you know, God fearing people, and they're going to be a light to the world. And that's all because of what happened at home. It all starts at home. So 
you know, like, like Hody said in this video, you know, sometimes the strength of a godly woman can be jarring. <laughs> you know, he had to remind her like, yo, okay, I understand the theology aspect of it, but you know, me and you are right. <laughs> so, you know, so that's, that's an awesome clip. Um, and like I said, I'm going to probably make one, one or two more clips. This is a, I'll, I'll post the link to the full uh, 11 minute segment in the description of this video.